Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Let's crack into another one. Uh, TNT. Yo. I have some things I'm waiting to tell you. You have some things that you I'm gonna let you pick. Do you want? Do you want? I want to hear about you coming out of the closet. That's finally. not one of the things. Do you want awful or weird? Hmm. That's an interesting choice. Yeah. Let's take awful. Okay. So uh, I asked you if you heard about Adam Johnson, hockey player. Adam Johnson. I think it's Adam Johnson. I better look it up because AJ AJ Styles, my favorite Backstreet Boy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Um, so, um, uh-huh. this guy was a hockey player. Okay. And he was in a game. I don't know the story. He was in uh, England playing. He used to play for the Penguins in the NHL. All right. They play a lot of uh, hockey. He out there. went to go do something, mm-hmm. and some guy kicked him in the throat and slit his throat. And he, you mean like the hockey guy? Like, yeah, like they were something happened, and he ended up getting his throat sliced with a skate. And he stood up and started skating towards his bench, holding his neck, and then he collapsed on the ice and died. Okay. Like he, so like basically like just, just, the most tragic ass thing that could happen in a hockey game. Yeah. Happened. Yeah. That I'm you know I like I'm 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 I'm, I'm not giving it the the gravity that it it needs because if I if I like let it infect my brain I'm going to have nightmares. Um I have a lot of irrational fears. This is actually one of them. Getting cut a neck cut by a hockey skate? I have an irrational fear of hockey rings. Yes, I do. There like are ice going to watch rings. a game? Like, or like being on the ice. Yeah, being on the ice is just like insane to me. Like ice skating is like, I don't know. I have an unnatural fear of ice skating. Um, this isn't the first time this has happened. This, In fact, if, I don't know if it's this... It's the first time somebody's died. It happened in another game and the guy didn't die. Yes, I was going to say, yeah. I know it's happened before, but I, know, I don't think the individual died. So, yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, it's a dangerous sport. I don't know if it were if it was something that could have been prevented, if it was something that maybe a guy was doing out of malice and maybe he missed Well, the reason I paused when I... Um... Uh-huh. Uh, when I brought when I, it just won the stories because I was re- googling the guy's name, make sure I had the name right. And sure. the headline that I found said Adam Johnson fallout continues. Decade old video appears to show Matt Pettigrave, the one who who did that, doing the same maneuver that resulted in on ice fatality in Saturday in England. So it's something that this guy has done before. So like everyone thought, oh, this is an accident. But like they, they, I guess they found like a ten year old clip of like the guy doing the same maneuver to somebody See, else. The, I haven't seen the video. I don't know what happened. The thing is, is that there's very little reason that the blade of your skate should be near anybody's head, face, chest, anything. Like yeah. there's rules in hockey for your stick being too high, let alone your goddamn feet with blades attached to them. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Happy Gilmore got banned for trying to take a skate off and stab somebody this dude sliced somebody's that's, neck that's a movie um so <laughs> I, yeah i don't know irrational fear of ice skates jones you ever been to like a roller skating rink i have never wait no. i've never ice skated before that's not what i asked so that's if you have a roller skate i have not put on a pair of roller skates i mean neither have i since i was a child under sure. 10 okay i remember being a young child maybe even the age of 10 or younger and at the skating rink, right? And I fell because, you know, obviously. Because that's what happens when you try to roller skate. And you, you don't know what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, and you're a child and you have like the. And it hurts like a bee. No, it's not that. I fell and then somebody rolled over my finger. Oh, God. Yes. Boom, and, boom. Did they get so, hurt? I mean, I don't even think they noticed. But I just remember the excruciating pain of having somebody roll over my prepubescent finger And it was like, it's one of those core memories that has stuck with me for the rest of my life. Now, fast forward, my first time at an ice skating rink, I fall. And somebody slices here. And all I can think of is, oh my God, if somebody were to roll over my finger here, I would lose my finger. Oh, that's scary. I ice skated for maybe 10 minutes, fell. Their irrational fears just took over and I've never touched the sport ever again. So that is why this story in particular is a little bit hurtful for me. I just can't, I can't, I can't comprehend. I mean, him. yeah, That's I mean, just, rest in peace, Adam Johnson. He, yeah, was, he wasn't that old or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but uh, when I used to go to the roller rink when I was a kid, 
you would go there for like birthday parties mm -hmm. and the birthday person got to ride around in a giant roller skate. They had like a literally like a sit in roller skate and somebody pushed you around the rink. So and it was I, like a, a four wheeler with like the roller skate. I don't skate know what it was made over. of. It was it was basically like a death trap with a plastic coat on it. It's probably like a but, tandem. And you bike. got to like you get to get pushed around and I never got to ride in the skate, man. I was sad. <laughs> And my mom never took me there for my own birthday, just other people's. <laughs> and what I would do was, like, I was really – I didn't like roller skates, so I would get the skates, barely ever go on the rink, and I would roller skate around and play video games. Yeah, yeah. I would, like, stand at the arcade machines, and yeah. then I'd be like, why am I wearing these skates? Yeah, 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 because then you're just, like <laughs> – Walking around hempered at the video game con Playing arcades. Double Dragon on the, the, the arcade machine. <laughs> and you're sliding around. Yeah, dude. I don't get it. Why people like that. Oh, so you're saying you don't understand why people like skating in general. Ice skating, roller skating. I get ice skating. I feel like that would be. You I feel, I feel, I feel like if you were good at it, it would be a lot of fun. You get ice skating, but not roller skating? I get they're, I get uh, the same thing. roller blading more. Oh my god! Now we're now we're splitting too many damn hairs, man. Listen. You can't say is that I understand one thing that is the same thing with different sh footwear versus another thing that is exactly the same thing except the wheels are different. It it feels a lot more unsafe. What does that mean? When you got quads, man. What is the, what is the limiting reagent that makes I, regular skating seem less legitimate than ice skating and or rollerblading? What is it about it? Is it because of its antiquatedness? Is it archaic? It's is your it it's your inability to like cut and shift. Your inability to cut and shift. Yeah. I don't know what that means. Like. If so you're, you're saying because he can't do cool tricks? <laughs> yeah, man. Like, but you, you can like, do cool tricks. On on a, a, who you seen do a cool trick on a roller I mean, skate? Nobody. <laughs> so where? What I ground? mean, look honestly. If you, I, I say nobody because nobody roller skates anymore. Um, but honestly, yeah. If you look, I'm sure. I'm. De in fact, definitely. There was definitely. My mom was one of those people who would get out there and roller skate backwards and get, oh, down, and get, get down and put her foot out. Oh, yeah. Straight. You get on one knee and put the foot out straight. Yeah, like, oh, come on, those are Those are roller skate tricks, I guess. Yeah, or they do the thing where they be going backwards and they do the crisscross with the legs and stuff. My mom could do that shit. I could never, never. That's terrifying. It is terrifying, but there's cool tricks you can do with roller skating. And I just it hurts think that when roller you fall. What's that? It hurts when you fall. It does hurt when you fall. It's a I very, feel like if I went roller wood. skating today, that I'd break my goddamn arm. Oh, uh, yeah, you know. Like when you're old and you hit the ground, it does not, you don't bounce as much as you used to when you were little. No, thank you for letting us all know what happens like when you get old. Like anyone who listens to this doesn't know that we're old. I'm not old. I don't claim that shit. I mean, right. only old in number, not in mindset. I don't claim the number either, all right? Okay. Age ain't nothing but a number. You ain't wrong. Br bring on... Tell that to all your girlfriends. Bring on, <laughs> on the 24-year-olds. Wow. What? Wow. They're, they're legal. Wow. They are! I mean... Either way. Yeah. Roller skating. <laughs> I don't know why you don't like roller skating, but yet... You, ice skating. You know what would be cool? As if they had ice skates with two sets of blades no, instead not, of one. I hate it. Well, it's like a sleigh. You just want to make me. You it's like a sleigh. It's like two sleighs for your feet. Sleighs have two rails. It's, no, no. It's just making me more nervous. It's like, honestly, ice skating is just like, why don't I just attach death traps to my. Why don't I just attach prison shifts to my feet? I don't understand that. Prison shivs to your feet. Yeah, let me just put these scalpels on on my my pedals and and walk around. I don't. Around. <clears throat> You're killing like people die. Nobody's ever gone to the skating rink. I bet you someone's and, fell and, and hit died, their head and died from having a skate over their neck. <laughs> you ain't wrong, but I bet someone's died from a head injury. Well, so I'm sure somebody died from head injury and ice skating too. If anything, you go faster when you ice skate. Because like those people, like the ice skating, like the the Olympics and the figure the skaters, pros, the pro hockey players, they're dude. going like forty miles per hour when they're out there like building like, up enough and they to do a check triple axel into the board. Oh, dude, and they just like crush. Oh, yeah, oh. The, yeah that, that would be scary. 
Yeah. And like the figure skater, they're going like 40 miles per hour and then they jump up in there and do 20 spins and come down looking graceful and shit. I'm like, you fall. Like you're a gazelle? Gonna, like, if you fall, you're going to bust your ass. And you know they've fallen a bunch of times before. I'm good, man. I'm good too. I'm going to tell you right now skating, inline skating, skateboarding, uh, what is it, hockey, screw it, ice skating, all those things, you can S my D. <laughs> I'm not going to do them. Wow. Not. I don't understand why humans want to jump in water and play with tigers and put put weird shit on their feet and glide around like a hoes. Why is there no Healy Championship? He- where's the Where's the Healy? I'm where's, sure a Healy boy would love to do it. Where's the World Healy's Cup? Oh my God! Anyways, go to thecrazytown.com and subscribe for Jonas. I'm not doing it. TNT. Oh, we out.